Long time no chat. <laughs> I have a very good reason why, I'm sorry, but that is because I'm actually pregnant. I have, I'm about 13 weeks pregnant and I've been so sick. The idea of pulling out the camera has sickened me even more to trying to keep a straight face and not be sick on film. Um, but I'm slowly coming out of it now. I think it's the majority of the bad bits have passed. So I'm hoping to record more frequent videos for you guys now so you can see our updates. Um, so let me give you a little bit of what we've been doing. We haven't actually done a lot in comparison to the first few videos where we were just powering ahead and we did a ridiculous amount of renovations in the first 30 days. <laughs> we've slowed right down for a couple of reasons. One, I was unwell. Two, I, we were tired. We needed a break. And three, Nick's actually gone and picked himself up some work. He's, he's doing a job. He's a painter. So he did a quote for a local. They wanted him to do it. It's a very big job. So he's been working on that, which means he hasn't been around to do renos. And there's not much I can do on my own when Heidi is around. But this is what we've been doing slowly on the weekends. So we dun, 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 got our wood heater delivered. Is that going to focus? There we go. So we got it delivered. We went to get it installed today and we can't because for a variety of reasons, the previous wood heater, which used to be there, has a really dodgy hole in the roof, like where the old flue was, the old chimney. And it's leaking. It's not very secure, which means that we need that part of the roof to be replaced. And if we replace, if we plumb this in today, like we had planned, when we get this roof replaced in a very short time, because we're approaching winter, which means rain, this bit is gonna have to be re-plumbed in again. So rather than to save, to save money and stopping having this to be plumbed in twice, because they're gonna replace the roof panel there, we're just gonna wait till next week. I was so disappointed. I was so excited to have a fire tonight, but it's not happening until next week. Anyway, we got it and it gives you an idea though of how it's gonna look. It's gonna be so amazing. Can't wait. Um, what else have we done? We, I think you've, I can't remember, I think you guys kind of saw this. Not much has happened in the kitchen. You know, we've been cooking. I'm making chicken noodle soup at the moment. Nick's been working on painting the window. We haven't installed any of the benches or anything. We just haven't had time, to be honest. And the other thing we've actually done, actually now that I remember, is this particular, this is actually a bedroom. Excuse the junk. But it's a tiny bedroom. Like, it's way too small. We measured to put a single bed in here and it literally took up half of the floor space. So we're turning, we were always going to turn this room into our larder. Um, but this room was disgusting. It had rank carpet, it had yellow walls, and a burgundy ceiling. That's right, a burgundy ceiling. And so, what we did, Nick painted it. He painted the walls some leftover paint that we had, um, just a neutral color, and he painted the ceiling, and he did all the trim work, and we've still got boxes in here that we haven't unpacked since we moved, but, we also oh, we also ripped off the old carpet and we um we just put these industrial carpet squares they're common for offices like um and we're okay with that like this is not a room we're going to be living in this is going to be our larder slash linen cupboard basically it's going to be an extended pantry and um linen cupboard you know because we don't have a lot of storage in this house this house doesn't have tons of cupboards like our old house used to have um so that's what we're turning this room into we're just going to get some shelving put along the walls so we can store lots of stuff and so this room was a quick easy fix it was only 200 dollars i think we spent on the carpet squares because we already had the paint we're just going to get an electrician to swap this light over because it's ugly and um, we might swap this door over as well because it's a bit wrecked. But other than that, we finished this room off, which kind of felt good because we only spent $200 and we technically 99% finished a room, like one more room off our to-do list, which was really good. But basically, that's all we've done. You know what? Actually, I'll stick some photos in now of what the room did look like before we started. I took a couple of photos at night, unfortunately, so the coloring isn't that great, but it gives you an idea of the fact that it used to be a burgundy ceiling and the yellow walls and disgusting carpet. So um, there you have it. Um, hopefully I can start doing more updates. I'm not due till November, so I'm still early days, so I'm just over three months, um, but Stay tuned if you want updates, watch what we do. And um, I wanted to start doing more videos also of just living life out here, not just the renovation component, because that's partly why I'm doing what I'm doing, 
it's about working from home and having that life transition and now that I'm feeling better I'm hoping I can do that I hope you have an amazing day please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time bye